Hello, this is uh, Henrik. We're uh, Saturday, November 4th, 2017. And I would like to share with you some thoughts and feelings on joy and sorrow. Your joy, you be, yay, <laughs> is, uh, is also your sorrow finally unmasked and free to blossom into your life and make you happy and enthusiastic, placing your spirit, your bright positive spirit in all you do and all you say and all you feel. At the very same well from which your laughter springs and rises was oftentimes filled with your tears as it was with mine in my own times of hardship and despair and trying to commune with the truth. Isn't that not so? I mean, frankly, how else can that be? The deeper that sorrow carves into our our being, the more joy we can contain. An equal amount of ecstasy will be given to the agony we experience. Is not the cup that holds your wine the very cup that was burned in the potter's oven in fire? And is not the lute, the flute, the violin that soothes your spirit the very wood that was hollowed with knives. When you are joyous, and that is a wonderful state to be in, then I would suggest you look deeply into your heart. And there you shall find it is only that which has given you sorrow that is giving you joy now. When you are sorrowful, look again into your heart, and you shall see that in truth you are weeping for that which has been your delight once as you were joyful about it. Some of you may say, joy is greater than sorrow. And others may say, no, sorrow, alas, is a greater. That I say unto you, if I may, joy and sorrow are inseparable. They both belong to us. Together they come, and when one sits alone with you in your state of being, at home or out and about, remember that the other is asleep upon your bed, <laughs> waiting for the next time you come to greet it. Verily, truly, and earnestly you are suspended like the scales of a balance between your sorrow and your joy. Only when you are empty are you at standstill and balanced. When the treasure keeper lifts you to weigh his gold and silver, then your joy or your sorrow rise or fall, depending on your level of wealth and health. So rejoice, my dear friends, and when you experience sorrow, Weep straight from the heart, for it will heal you. In all cases, love will always be our best remedy 